Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back to episode 24 of the FIFA 21 My Player Career. And we've totally forgot to do the traits for the Kai character, so what we're going to do is add them now. Uh, I don't know if there's a limit on these, we've unlocked, what, 5, 6, 7 so far. Uh, can we choose them all? Let's have a look. Uh, early crosser, we can it seems, and long throw in, so we can unlock them all and choose them. Um, so that's all done we've got the traits added there for Kai hopefully that helps him with his goal scoring and creativity going forward uh, we do have Manchester City first up in today's episode at the iPro Stadium who is going to come out on top with this game hopefully Derby can cause a little bit of an upset obviously it is going to be City who are the favourites uh, but Derby County had a fairly decent start to the Premier League season we've still got a long way to go of course the main aim is just to keep Derby in the league uh, we don't want any relegation battle and I don't think we're going to get one uh, but three points here today would really help the players confidence we're currently seventh in the Premier League as it stands we're just above Chelsea actually and just behind Liverpool uh, so as I said a fairly decent start to the Premier League for Derby County and that's play through and Sergio Aguero he is on side as well so it is going to count it is Aguero number 10 who scores his first goal in today's game, gives the away team the lead, and now the Rams do have some work to do. Uh, good little through ball there for Aguero. Didn't see who it was who played it through. Let's see by the replay. It's their great through ball defense. Sleeping number 26, I believe it was, who played that one through for Aguero to score his second league goal of the season. And onwards we go then. Some words to do then, as I said, for Derby County. But as you can tell by the top left, time is running out. And Derby not really had a chance to do anything, if I'm totally honest. You can see by Kai's overall rating for this game. He's on a 6.9, 6.8. He keeps switching between right now. And just can't get our hands on the ball at all. It's been all City from start to finish. And it looks like they are going to be taking the three points home with them. And they're just holding on to possession right now. Exactly what they need to be doing. One minute of added time remaining. That has been played. And now we'll just wait for that final whistle to blow. And there it is. City take the win. Three points for them. As they do challenge for the Premier League title, of course. Uh, nothing we could do ourselves. Disappointing there. But you would have said that Manchester City were the big, big favourites going into that one. Uh, but we do have a Midlands derby next up for the Rams. Hopefully we can get ourselves back to uh, winning ways here against Leicester City. Once this game is over, we do have one more game as well in today's episode. And that is in the Carabao Cup. Uh, we're still wanting to get ourselves all the way to the final in the Carabao Cup if we can. Um, so we'll see. I think we're playing against Fleetwood. I could be wrong with that. Um, Forest Green Rovers possibly I know it begins with an F I've totally forgot who we um, take on in the next round of the Carabao Cup but we'll find out once this Leicester game is over and done with let's try and get ourselves uh, the win in this one before we even think about the Carabao Cup game here's Graham Schiller then for Derby County early possession here for the Rams 6.2 rating for Kai 6.3 right now here he is just lays that one off Christian Billick onto this near side Come on, get the ball in the middle. Oh, it's going to be a penalty. He handballed that, blocked it with his arm. So an early chance here. Less than 10 minutes gone. And a chance for Derby County to give themselves a one-goal lead. And it is going to be Wayne Rooney. Who steps up then for Derby? And is it the post? Can we get it back in there quick? Here's Kai. Turns into the defender. Loses possession. And Leicester City get the ball clear. But what... A penalty that was from Wayne Rooney. You would have been expecting him to smash it into the back of the net. Uh, but unfortunately, he could not even beat the woodwork. And the score does remain 0-0. 7.3 match rating for Kai. So he is getting a little bit better here in this game as it does progress through. There's going to be a late um, throw in in the first half here for Leicester City with Ricardo now. Plays that one inside, cross is there, and the header was almost there, and the referee is given a penalty. Not sure what that penalty is given for, 
Let's see if we get to see the replay. We don't even get to see the replay this time, which is a bit of a shame. But Andre Wisdom, he gives away the penalty and chance for Leicester then on the stroke half time to take lead. And they've done exactly that. 7.2 match rating for Kai. He's just gone down from a 7.4 after Leicester City scored that penalty kick. But the home team there in front, one goal to nil. Mailing it is number 10, I believe it is. Um, giving the Foxes the one goal lead. Top corner. Goalkeeper just watches it go past him. Nothing he could do with that one. Uh, but Daniel Malin, he scores his fourth Premier League goal of the season as we do head into the second half here. Leicester leading by one goal to nil. Kai still hovering around the 7.3 mark as it stands. Uh, just over 20 minutes to play. The Foxes on the attack inside the Derby half. Nice cross onto this near side. Can he get the cross in though? He's got space to do that right now. The crosses are even needed. Look at this. Easy passes. So much space in the middle of the uh, area there for the Foxes to just pass around into. And there is another goal. Leicester lead two goals to nil. Derby really struggling today, aren't we? Not sure what is up with the Rams, but it has been a poor, poor week. Hopefully, though, we can pick it up in our next game in that Carabao Cup match. Uh, but look at that. Absolutely shocking defensive work there from Derby County. Pierre Lise Melou. He gets Leicester's second. They lead two goals to nil. And we've got just over 10 minutes remaining. Derby running out of time. If they're going to fight back here, can they do so? Here's Wayne Rooney. Gives the ball forward there for Kai. Picks it up just inside his own half. Max Bird sees the run. Finds Kai as well. The run is on on his near side. Get the cross in. They've got space. Cross comes in. It's gone towards Kai. Kai nods it down. And that one goes into the back of the net. I was going to say cross it in earlier because there was another player in there who was in so much space, had so much time, but he saw Kai there at the near post and there he is to head it in. We've pulled a goal back. We will have enough time to try and get ourselves an equaliser. Hopefully we can. Good header though, that one. Defender was almost there ahead of Kai, but there he is to score his eighth Premier League goal of the season. GG to him. He's pushing towards that 20 goal mark, of course. That is the tally, the target, I should say, uh, for Kai as we head into injury time. Time is almost over. Two goals to one for Leicester City. And they're just wasting time now in this corner. And I think that is going to be game over. It's going to have a late corner even here for Leicester. And once this is played, I'm sure the referee will blow the final whistle. 8.9 match rating for Kai. So in himself he's had a decent game but Derby overall the defensive work has really been slacking do we have enough time we do not there blows the final whistle then here it does end Leicester City 2 Derby County 1 the home fans happy with that league win of course and uh, not so much though for Philip Koku onwards we go it is against Forest Green I knew it did begin with an F um, so the fourth round of the Carabao Cup, who's going to be coming out on top? Derby got to be the big favourites for this one. Uh, it is Forest Green who get this game underway. Let's try and get ourselves an early goal. We've had two disappointing results against Manchester City and Leicester City. Um, so let's try and get ourselves the, the morale back up within the starting 11. And hopefully get ourselves into the next round of the Carabao Cup. Here is... Uh, Knight on that far side looking to get the cross in. There is the cross. Defender was there first. And a nice save there from Thomas, the goalkeeper. A little bit of luck going our way with the deflection from the defender. Uh, but good defensive work from the goalkeeper. Corner gets swung in. And it is going to go out of play, is it? It is going to go out of play for another corner. Um, so still the chance here for Derby County to break the deadlock. Only 11 minutes played. There is a corner towards Kai, but cleared by Evans. Kai picks it up, though, just outside the area and loses it. Derby somehow still keep possession. Here is Kai. Go, on, go for the finesse. Oh, he tried to cut inside. Still a little bit of luck going our way again. Kai hits it on the edge of the area. And we do finally break the deadlock. All the attacking play that we was trying there just was going against us. Especially when Kai had the, the ball at his feet. But somehow... The deflections went our way and Kai was in space on the edge of the area. He took a touch, smashed it into the back of the net, it flies. And there we go, one goal to nil. There was a touch, beautiful little touch there just to open up the space for himself around that defender. 
And that's his second goal, I believe, in the Carabao Cup. It is. There is confirmation. So one goal to nil. Just over half an hour played as Forest Green are in possession. Trying to find themselves an equaliser before the second half um, starts. Can they do so? Good chance there from Kai. Nice tackling. He's up to an 8.2 now. Dwayne Holmes finds Kai. Has Kai got the pace? I think he has here. Look at the possession for Forest Green. They've had 71% possession. Derby really been struggling to get a hand on the ball. But there we go. A good shot from Kai. Would have been expecting him to put that one into the back of the net. At least get it on target. But it does fly wide of the post there. So into the second half we go. 9.1 match rating for Kai. Nice passing play here for the Rams. Keeping possession. Trying to get ourselves an early goal in the second half. Kai again. He's got plenty of opposition around him. Somehow keeps the ball though. Plays that one through. Dwayne Holmes hits it near post. And Derby County double their lead. And Kai's now gone up to a 10 rating. As Derby lead then two goals to nil. Dwayne Holmes, number 25, getting himself his first goal of the game. Kai did well there to hold on to possession. Plays that one through between the two defenders. Good finish there from Holmes. And one step into the next round then, I guess, for Derby County. There he is, the goal scorer. His third League Cup goal of the season. Just over half an hour to play. Derby lead, two goals, no. Forest Green in possession, losing it just inside the Derby half. Here is Kai. What's he going to do? There's loads of space on this near side for the run. He does lay it off eventually. Here's Knight. Kai's asking for it in the middle. Look at the space. And he puts it past the keeper. I was going to say he crosses it, but he didn't. He went for a cross shot across the keeper is what I meant to say. Yeah, but there we go. Three goals, nil for Derby County. Looking good. And I think that is pretty much game over then for Forest Green. It is going to be Derby County heading into the next round of the Carabao Cup. Unless something dramatic happens here, which I can't see happening. Uh, but with two goals in the bag, let's try and secure the hat-trick then for Kai. And that will be his fourth Carabao Cup goal of the season as well. If we do manage to get him another goal, he's stolen the ball yet again. He's tackling. Has been really on point today, I have to say. But that is a little bit of a heavy touch. And Dorby, loose possession, but the back in possession. And Kai, good skill, opens up the space, shoots. And again, the cross shot across the goalkeeper into the bottom corner. And that is his 40th career goal as well, I believe, now for Kai. As we did unlock one of the accomplishments, which is, I believe, finishing plus one. Uh, but good play from Dorby. And look at that nice little skill. Opens up enough space for himself. Takes off the shot across the goalkeeper. And it is now Forest Green Rovers nil. Derby County 4. And that's the fourth goal as well actually in the Carabao Cup for Kai. Three in today's game. So he is the hat-trick hero. And hopefully... I was going to say hopefully taking on some more goals. But we're into the final minute. Four minutes of added time remaining. Um, are Forest Green going to get themselves consolation? We would like a clean sheet here. Kai will be taking home the match ball as well for this game after bagging his hat trick. So after a, a, a bit of a, a tough week against Leicester City and Manchester City, dropping to two defeats, at least we are going to be ending today's episode with um, a win and one step into the next round of the Carabao Cup. And we will have a quick look at the other results as well in this competition, but there is confirmation Kai takes home the hat trick. Um, and the match ball, uh, good good uh, play from him all round as well from the Derby County boys. Leicester won, Chelsea won, Spurs won, so some st big teams still in the competition. Uh, well, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you did enjoy. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.